all good. In this video, we will analyze and understand the style and visualization stage of setting a Yusugugi banner on Adopt. To access the stage, simply click on this icon or on style in the side menu. Here we have the possibility to customize the disclaimer according to your site's layout, your brand. And here we have a light theme and a dark theme. This is because Adopt provides the option for two different customizations if your website has the capability to support multiple themes. If it does not have this capability, make the changes only in this first field. This initial stage refers to changes in color. So in this case, we have the opportunity to modify the primary colors, text, and background of the cookie banner. By clicking on each of the cards, you will have the option to change the colors using RGB codes, hexadecimal codes, or even by clicking and dragging your mouse cursor here in the color selection field provided on the interface. We already have the notice set up pre-configured with Pepsi's visual identity. The second choice here would be in reference to the utilization of the accept and reject buttons with the identical color scheme and appearance. During the second stage, we are presented with a range of choices for determining the position of the cookie banner. We can opt for it to appear either on the right or left side or in the center and on the bar or in the center and at the top. Furthermore, we have the flexibility to retain the default format or customize it according to our preferences. Additionally, we also have the option to modify the disclaimer theme to a modern alternative or keep it as the default option depending on the desired aesthetic and user preference. I will keep it as default. Moreover, we also have the possibility to change the controller icon, thereby being able to use a lock icon, a cookies icon, upload a new icon, or even a new image, such as your company's logo or your brand image, if desired. Here we have the Pepsi logo as an example. This card, Disclaimer Text, is solely dedicated to making changes to the text in the notice, thereby allowing for modifications to be made to specific regulations and in the desired language of preference. The gray cards are fields for editing. You can click on the text and make the changes that you desire in these cards, which serve as editing fields. All text can be edited. It is not mandatory, but Adopt provides this customization possibility for users who may want to personalize their texts. In addition, we also have a language configuration feature that enables you to change the language you want as a default. Moreover, if you wish to remove any language from the notification options, you also have the option to deselect them individually, ensuring maximum customization and flexibility. Make sure not to forget to save the change so that the notice receives this important information and it is properly updated. This final piece of information is specifically related to the class overlap of tags within the cookie banner that is displayed on the website. What does this mean? By enabling this option, your website and cookie banner will be influenced by the designs and design choices on your site, ensuring a consistent and cohesive visual experience for your visitors. To put it differently, specifics like font, size, spacing can have an influence on the visual aspect of the Cox banner that is configured in this particular location within the Adopt application. If you make the decision to enable this option, please ensure to check how your banner will appear and be displayed on your website. If you observe any alterations, any adjustments to the banner in this location within the platform and on your website, we suggest that you verify if you appreciate it or else deactivate this choice. Don't forget to save and publish all the options, all the changes made here so that they reflect on your book span. If you have any questions, please contact us via ticket or here in the chat. I hope I have helped.